My name is Elise Hammond. I am a sophomore here at Mizzou. My major is middle school math and social studies education with a minor in leadership and public service. I came to Mizzou for my first visit uh, the summer before my senior year and I had been visiting a lot of different colleges at the time. I knew I was going to be an education major. I came to Mizzou and they handed me, this is what you're going to be taking for the next four years if you decide to come here. Right here, you get into the classroom. These 16 weeks, your student teaching. So it was a really great transparency where I could see exactly what I had coming for me, you know, what classes I had to take, that program of study that I could see ahead of time. I've been able to plan in my minor, which is, you know, not math or social studies like my degree. What I really liked about the program was that it was an entire college of education, not within, a, you know, a college of arts and sciences. So I know that when they figured out my general education requirements, those were, every single class was what they believe is important for an educator. It's not important for anybody who's going into biology or psychology or this or this. It's we think these classes are necessary for you as a future educator. Something else I really liked about the program was that I'm not just taking all math classes and I'm not just taking all education classes. I take about 22 hours of math classes and then I take an additional, I think it's like 9 or 15 classes about how to teach math. So I know I had a bunch of teachers in high school who were really great mathematicians, but they didn't have that connection between uh, their students and the subject. So with Mizzou, um, when I start taking my methods classes, I will be able to have that connection. Along with the program of study, uh, it's also really nice because our, since we are a Research One facility, every professor is doing research and it's really easy to get involved in that or even just have your professor sharing that information with you. And I've had the opportunity recently to be involved with uh, fourth through seventh graders and how they uh, use pictures to do math to understand math, which has been really interesting for me to see their drawings and see, you know, we, t we ask them to do a picture, but they have no idea how to use pictures to help them solve problems. So it gets you thinking and you're always synthesizing between uh, your, what, you're, what you're learning and how students are thinking from your research and you're like, wow, that's, I totally didn't realize that people wouldn't understand it that way.